Organisms that cannot be seen by naked eyes and only can be seen through a microscope are called microorganisms. Organisms can be divided into two types, unicellular organisms and multicellular organisms. Ovum pula ialah sel pembiakan perempuan yang merupakan sel yang paling besar dalam badan manusia. Apabila ovum disenyawakan oleh sperma, proses pembentukan bayi akan berlaku di dalam badan perempuan. There are many apparatuses in the science laboratory. Can you name them? You must use the correct apparatus for each experiment during an investigation. Test tube holder to hold the test tube or boiling tube during heating. A microscope has different functions for each part. For example, eyepiece can magnify the image of a specimen. Nerve cells are the basic unit in the human nervous system and it conveys messages to the whole body. Skeletal system Muscular system Digestive system Blood circulatory system The function of our stomach is to digest the food that we eat. By understanding the tissues in the human body, we can clearly see the cell organization now. When the submarine dives, water will be pumped into the ballast tanks. Cell membrane encloses the cytoplasm and controls the movement of materials in and out of the cell. When the water is heated, water molecules are moving faster and pushing each other further apart. When the end of X is heated, heat is transferred to the iron rod in the order of X, A, B, C and D. The soil and water in the measuring cylinders are weighed. This occurs at a temperature known as a freezing point, where the temperature does not decrease even though the cooling continues. Commonly used radioactive substances are uranium and plutonium. The sun provides solar energy that radiates light energy and heat energy. 
air pollution occurs when there are harmful pollutants in the air and affects the quality of air that will damage the environment.